So today um, we are making pinwheels and I have an example of what the end result is going to be like. So everybody is getting a straw um, and just be mindful that the end is sharp on purpose but that's not the end we're working with. So you're each getting a pinwheel straw and you're getting the gold paper that has the pinwheel example or the pinwheel cutout on it and um, we have modeling clay and we have straight pins and we have a pair of scissors. So we're gonna talk about what powers you and about wind power. And then we're going to go ahead and cut out and write our stuff. So first thing I want you to do is write what powers you on your pinwheel. And um, you wanna write it down the edge this way so that the line, so you're kind of like writing on the, the line that doesn't have the dot, sorry. <coughs> So, yeah, so right above the dot. So I'm gonna give you a pinch of the modeling clay. And what this does is it gets stuck in the edge, end of your straw, so the non-sharp end. Roll it up and stick it in the non-sharp end of your straw. And then, um, yep, like in a tube, yep. And it, just shove it in and then um, if it doesn't fit, um, put a little bit more in. So you might not need all that and you can give it back to me. We'll just put it back in this bag, so whatever we don't use. Yep, and you can either break it off and like put it in, put some in and then do that. So that it all goes in. We're really just filling in the very, very end of it. We're kind of giving it um, some support because this is where we're going to stick the straight pin through. So you just kind of want to be filling that very end in. So um, <laughs> then everybody's getting a straight pin found in this envelope. And you're going to cut out your pinwheel along the edge. So everywhere that has a dotted line, you're going to cut. So let me see your, um, make sure that you've got that in there. So let me see your modeling clay and make sure that it's got enough in there. So we're gonna share our scissors. Be good neighbors, right? Got a power through. So, um, so you've got your, what powers you written on your pinwheel. You've got your modeling clay on that and I think that's good. Um, so you don't cut on the circle, you just cut on the dotted lines. And so, we end. so what's that? Right. So, yeah. So you want to? It wants to stay in a square when we're finished. So just down the dotted line. Yep. And then I'll give you a pin. I'll put it here. And then um, there's like wind facts on here, so we get the different things about energy and wind facts. Yep. <laughs> so there's little dots, um, and we're going to take the dots, and we're going to connect them to the center. And since you wrote on this side, I'm going to use the opposite of the dots for yours so that your stuff shows. Um, so I'm going to, instead of putting the pin through where the dots are, I'm going to put it in the opposite so that what you wrote is still visible. Does that make sense? Yeah. Okay. So I'm putting the pin through the end, like this, every end. And then the pin goes through that very center dot of the center of the pinwheel, that circle. Do you see that little center dot? Okay, so then this pin goes through there. And then, see how like each end and your stuff is still showing? You're gonna stick it through that end. So stick your pin through the end of your, where your modeling clay is. Um, that's okay. All right, so I think yours is, so you're gonna take, yep, you're gonna do the opposite. So um, you're gonna put the pin through the end that doesn't have the dots because of where you did your writing. And then this one, and then, yep, that one. And then this one, yep. And then, so go ahead and stick it through that. Well, I guess this will 
good. And so we're going to stick it through this last one. And then you want to bend your pin down on the other end, the sharp end, so that it goes flat against your straw. And then through the center dot. Yep. And then put it through the end of your uh, straw that has a model play in it. And then you see how I've bent my straw, I mean, bent my um, straight pin down so that it's not poking out straight. So once it goes through the side of the straw, just kind of fold it down a little bit so it's not still sharp. We can talk about what powers you and wind energy. Let me see. Looks pretty good to me. So you should be able to blow on it in towards the center and have it um, have it go. So try blowing towards the center like <laughs> mine was actually, I was just walking down the hall and it was moving. So it was just the slightest. <coughs> it wants to. <laughs> Maybe when you don't have cold. So pretty easy, right guys? All right. Thank you. Okay.